Car Electrical System Explained. In automobiles, especially the modern ones, varieties of parts are electronics and operate electrically. Well, charging systems are the basic electrical system in a vehicle which include an alternator, battery and voltage regulator. These components are a source of power to other electrical components in the vehicle. Starting from the electrical motor, sensors, gauges, heating element, headlights, brake and trafficator lights, radio, television, air conditioning system, blowers, interior lights, refrigerator system, ignition system, etc. All these components receive power from a battery and the battery is charged by the alternator. Note, when the engine is running, all electrical devices are powered with the alternator regulator's power. This is because the alternator output is greater than the battery current when the engine is running. If you have found this video to be interesting, just a friendly reminder to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And let's continue with the video. Components of Vehicle Electrical System Magneto A magneto ignition system, or high-tension magneto, is an ignition system that uses magneto to create high voltage for the generation of electricity. The electricity generated is further used to run vehicles and other electrical components in the system. The magneto is a combination of a distributor and generator built as one unit, making it different from the conventional distributor that creates spark energy without external voltage. Alternator An alternator is one of the major and inevitable parts of a vehicle charging system as it plays the best role. The electrical power that charges the battery is from the alternator, but the current produced is alternating current AC. This AC power is immediately converted to direct current DC because automobiles use a 12-volt DC electrical system. Voltage Regulator The voltage regulator controls the alternator's power output. This device is often located in the alternator as it regulates the charging voltage that the alternator produces. It keeps the voltage between 13.05 and 14.5 volts to protect the electrical parts in the vehicle. Battery A battery is another essential component in a vehicle charging system, as it serves as a reservoir of electrical power. An engine starter motor is directly connected to the positive terminal. It helps to crank the component, making the engine start. As the engine is running, the alternator directly charges the battery. The battery can also supply power to the electrical components when the engine isn't running. Working Principle All electrical devices in a vehicle are designed with switches or relay systems with the major source of energy, battery, all receiving power. So immediately the engine starts the starter motor, which is an electrical device that receives power from the battery. The combustion process keeps the engine running and the alternator is used to charge the battery. This alternator's voltage is less than the battery voltage when the engine is not running. This is because the current from the battery is used to power the vehicle loads and not the alternator. Alternators are designed with diodes that prevent current from flowing into them. In a situation where the engine is running, the alternator's current output is greater than the battery voltage. The current flows from the alternator to the electrical load in the vehicle and the battery to charge it up. If this video was very informative, go hit the subscribe button right now and I'll see you in the next video.